this girl's gonna choose her next boyfriend based on their cars. But every round she's gonna eliminate one person until she finds her true love. It's like my RX-7, I'm trying to figure out a way to get us started. Hey. <laughs> you mess with Vietnamese people? You do red flag. Are you VTech? Because I'm trying to bang on you like a limiter. Ooh. Oh. No, man. You can only eliminate one. I think I would have to eliminate. But first, let's meet our bachelorette. What do you do? Currently, I'm just drifting, working on my clothing brand. What would you say is like a car that's like a red flag to you? People who drive the series, they're always weird. What type of guys that are you into? Do they have to be a car guy? Preferably, if you know more than about cars than him, it's mm. embarrassing. Why are you single? I'm super picky. I look at the guy's personality and like his mindset. I love funny guys. Okay, we got plenty of goofy guys in here. You know what I'm saying? They definitely gonna make you laugh for sure. I'm hoping that like as we get to know each other, we can do get something cheap and then you know, Oh yeah! You, uh, oh yeah! Yeah? <laughs> wow. Also, if things go well, we can get hot, hot and spicy. And spicy. I know. Um, where, where are you from? Wait, what's your name? Oh sh Oh yeah, my name's Eric, sorry. This is, this is, this is my <laughs> second time talking to a woman. The first time was the first time you Bro, he's me nervous. On. He's nervous, bro. What happened to your car? Why is it towed? <laughs> oh, why is it towed? Oh, because I blew it up. That, I just want to show like my bad <laughs> moments, you know. A piece of metal went through the the, the intake and then it imploded like three pistons. That was the second time I blew it up, so I blow a lot of things up. So I yeah, I a little little messy. I am Gio. Nice to meet you. So I heard you're like into drifting. So like, what drift car do you have? Uh, E36 right now. But do you do drifting? I'm in the car. I don't do drifting. I I track. I'm from Chicago. I don't know if you know where that is. It's a little far from where you're at. There's one in Blackhawk and then there's one in Gingerman. Ooh, I don't know if you heard about it. That's clean though. I ain't gonna count. Like what? car do you track i track with this one yeah oh if you know do you know what car this is honestly no what oh, is this try to guess, wow. try to guess. i'm not the best with jdm guys it looks like a honda it's no? a ferrari uh <laughs> <laughs> What's well, so funny? It's a Ferrari. I mean, like it's just it's like it's just blue. Like <laughs> yeah, it's one of the Ferraris. older Ferraris. Like, Notice well, the uh, red know. caliper paint. Yeah, the red calipers. You know, it's like blue on blue. It's a really nice spec. I still don't know what car it is, guys. Please. Wow, me. that is. I think that's a good thing, though, is it not? That you don't know what car it is. It's, it means I'm like different, no? <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna move you to Whoa. the next round. What car is Ferrari, that? Ferrari. Wait, you not see the red calipers? Nah, I'm playing with you. Yeah, you got it right with the Honda part. What would you rate the car? One through ten. The fitment's good. The wheels is good too, I guess. Uh, but like, you don't mess with the TEs. Yeah, I like the TEs. That's oh, you said I you like guess. It looks really like very, very fat looking. <laughs> Like chubby, the car looks chubby. Okay. <laughs> like say uh, two minutes on the clock, do your thing. Shit. How do you say your name? Vu. Oh, where are you from? Texas. Okay. Okay, what do you think about Mini Coopers? I like man. Mini Coopers. Super fun, simple car. Vu, do you have any uh questions for her? I don't f know, bro. <laughs> anything ask her anything her favorite color her favorite food you know what i'm saying what car is she into what's her dream car well what car are you into more like euros my boy over here is vietnamese you you mess with vietnamese people kids with the red flag ah! <laughs> wait wait wait, wait, wait. Different, Jared. Oh, what? i born raised overseas bro <laughs> okay wait wait wait, wait 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 what do you think uh vietnamese people are red flag I think you guys like to party a lot, right? Uh, so. It's so good to meet you. My name is Nikolai. Hi. Where are you from? Indonesia. Oh, that's cool. I'm originally from Russia, but I live in the, in Georgia now in the US. So how long have you been in the cars? Since forever. I mean, my whole family loves cars, so. I've been in the cars my whole life as well. Um, I don't have any family that's in the cars, but ever since I was born, I've just been super passionate about cars. You guys are you talking about Nikolai, changing gear? Nikolai uh, fumbling? Huh? Are you talking about changing gear? You're switching. You know what? Oh. Like, yeah, yeah, I got you. No, I think it's a good car, um, especially for figure eights. Him. It's really he has like um some technical difficulties. His image for his car. I can't show any. I'm at work. I'm not even gonna lie about it. I'm at work. Uh, that's how you know I'm dedicated. I'm a good man. What What do you do? I'm a maintenance man. I like those plushies in the bag. You like plushies? Thank you. Yeah. Of course. Cute. Of course. Now I know at least when we go on our first date. I know exactly what I gotta bring for a gift. I gotta bring some roses and some plushies. Uh, got, it, got it, got it, got it. Yeah. That's time's up. All right, Mikey. Well, tie me, well, tie me back in. Well, I'm, not, <laughs> I'm not done. Look at her. Tie me back in. This is his car. I'm sorry, but it looks like 
a PT cruiser. The shape. Do you understand? What, okay. Like, it's like... Okay. <laughs> wait, what, wait, so you don't like this? I know, it's gonna get so bad if I say that. What would you rate his uh, car 1 through 10 right here, the picture I'm showing you right now? I've driven Lambos, I've driven Ferraris, but I gotta say, the real luxury is if you were my passenger princess, because it will... Oh my god. I know this oh. car is really good for drifting. Definitely, definitely. I've been drifting for a pretty long time now. How long have you been drifting for? It's just since, like, you December. Think very oh, swear? If you ever wanted to like, use some tandems, you know, that may be a cool first date, you know? If you just want to, you know, do that. trust me, you lead and I'll just tuck in real nice right there. I'll be the big spoon, you be the little spoon car, you know, we just keep going together. How's your day going? Good, just waking up. Oh, waking up? Well, I'm getting ready to go to bed. It's it's kind of late over here. Where are you from? I'm from Indonesia. Oh, that's Where super cool, from? though. Oh, I'm from Las Vegas. Have you ever been there before? Yeah, of course. It's a picture of my car right there. It's um it's R34 sedan, SR20 swapped. Are you happy? Like, finally? I, I like it. I oh, like it a lot. Yeah. I would love, like, an R34, like, GTR or something. But that's that's way out of my budget. You know what I'm saying? I'm a college student, so I'm trying to... I gotta keep. I gotta keep it to the four doors. Respectable. Where would you take me for our first date? I'm a beach kid, so I would say let's go to the beach. On the bike, bro. I'm kind of scared because it's more dangerous. Oh, I know this good sushi place. I know this good Italian place. We can go, you know, whichever one you're feeling. Big observation wheel that we have in Las Vegas. It's called the High Roller. You know, so I'm gonna take you out there, and then afterwards, maybe we can get some dessert and just get to know know each other. Do a nice <laughs> lunch. Right after that, we can head to the track. You and me would we'll take our cars drifting. I think that'd be pretty cute. You know, after a drift day, I help the car like put on the trailer. You know, uh, get some food and honestly, I think more than more than anything, a nice good conversation. Grab some like good eats. We can get a nice little coffee coffee run in, in the cars. Get a Pilates workout in, and then uh, go cruise somewhere nice. Maybe hit the canyon or something and uh, go out for a nice dinner wherever you want. Here in California, everything's kind of expensive, so I take you probably on like a boba day because that shit's like $5 a person. I spent all my money on cars. <laughs> then I take you to a nice back road. No we can way. hit like the private roads, you know? We take my super clean 350Z. I'll clear all the check engine lights, and then you could teach me how to maybe like slide it on there. A nice learning date for me okay. and you. Okay. So for so for you, got it. <laughs> yeah, for me, for me mainly. So first thing I do is fly over there, take you out near Jakarta Bay because there's a lot of stuff, fun stuff to do there. Maybe we can start like pick, uh, Pegasus carding at like the Pluit Village Mall. Go do some nice shopping. I can take some cute photos of you. I have a whole camera set up. I know how to shoot. You know, it's probably like late in the evening. What we can do is we can go rent some sea dudes, right? Sea dudes like a jet ski. In Thailand, jet skiing out in the bay while the sun sets is like was one of the most beautiful experiences I've ever had. So I want to show that, share that with you because, you know, it kind of reminds me of you. Look at, he, this is research, guys. Bro, show us your screen. You know you're on Google right now. Why are you lying? <laughs> Every girl likes a guy that prepares. I want to be prepared, even if it's in the country I haven't been. Let's do one more thing. What is your best pickup line? It's finally June, so let me turn Juni into your heart. <laughs> <laughs> what you that right. mean? Talk about it. Okay, I got oh, backup. Bro. I got backup. I got backup. I got backup. So, are you a cloud? Because I want you. What? <laughs> the fuck? Kezia, do you have a map on you? Because I'm getting lost in your eyes right now. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Okay. 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 My pickup line would obviously be in person, right? Mm -hmm. So I'd be like, hey, do you want to step mm -hmm. outside and get some fresh air? Because you just took my breath away. I, I ran out of pickup lines, but how about I just pick you up at nine? Mm -hmm. Oh. 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 I like that. Nine is too late. Oh. Oh. Nine a.m. Nine a.m. Nine a.m. is crazy. Nine a.m. Nine a.m. for brunch and car cards and coffee and brunch. I'd like to take you to the movies, but they don't let you bring your own snacks in. Mm. <laughs> mm. Oh. I guess like my RX-7, I'm trying to figure out a way to get us started. <laughs> It doesn't it doesn't run right now, so that <laughs> no, you don't have to add that last part. You just, oh, oh shit, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It's smart oh, sometimes, it's smart sometimes. Most of the time. Forty percent of the time. It was so good, Eric. It's so good. Oh, shit, my bad. Are you V Tech? Because I'm trying to bang on you like a limiter. Ooh, oh no man. Dude, that's for Jerry. That was for Jerry no, right there. Man. Oh, dude. If she, if she if she don't want you, I want you. Hi, YouTube. Hey, can I go again? I think I got a better one. Oh, go, go, okay, go. okay, go ahead. On a scale of one through ten, I'd rate this car an eleven, just like you. Oh, I like it. Like what? Like <laughs> oh, 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 that shit better. was ass. Damn, bro, I'm gonna get pencil for this. Say it. Say it. Say it. Say it. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. We all go down. <laughs> 
bro, I'm gonna get canceled, bro. Like, 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 like heavy or like, 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 <laughs> wait, there's so amazing. much build up nah, for nah. nothing. What is it gonna be? Who is gonna be eliminated? You can only eliminate one. Uh, I would say sorry, Eric. Oh. Oh. Every time, oh. 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 what's your call? No it's a ten dollars. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> you already kind of gave him like, oh, you know what? Everything's so expensive, and now let's just go and get boba. Like, shit. What? Oh, I knew it was that. Oh. Okay, yeah. Wait, let's be that's let's fair. be real. Obviously, it might be a low investment, but he's willing to invest you in the future. But it starts off e one. It's not like he could take you up on like a Japan trip straight away. It's like asking that. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Man, bro, I, I could. No, I could. Barbie. What do you think about how he looks? Do you regret your decision? <laughs> no, I can't. <laughs> But again, how much is he willing to put right. effort? It was real. Yeah. Bye. 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 Okay. Wait, did he get eliminated? The like first, the, the last time. first time. The last yeah. first time. Oh my god. Well. What is something that uh you offer to her no other man can offer? Because I know you said you like sushi, salmon, yellow tail, whatever you want. I can prep it all for you. We can have ourselves a little private sushi dinner date. Uh I'll let you do whatever you need to do, reach your goals and whatnot. I'll offer all of me. I would give you everything I have. If I had twenty dollars, I would give Does you twenty dollars. I travel a lot. I think it'd be cool if you traveled along with me because I go to a lot of really cool, unique places. Um, lots of cool <laughs> high end car shows. I'm loyal. You know, I think that's hard to find in a guy nowadays. Everyone, they've got their side chicks. They're they're following people on Instagram. They got their hidden little TikTok pages. And if we were dating, you know, I'd have none of that. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I can cook right now. I mean, you're gonna you're gonna cook for her? Yeah, I can do that. Show her uh, the the Vietnamese culture. You feel me? Maybe a little bit of bun sale, a little bit of uh, bun me. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna yeah, I can cook that. Easy, okay, bro. Okay, see, see, he 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 yeah. wants to cook for you, Kaz. So I mean, what I can offer is that I'm be quick to get to know you and what you need, like to have like that supportive partner come out of you. That's what I have to offer. Mm -hmm. Good at learning. I would say eliminate Boo because like he didn't talk much. Cat, hey, so oh, cool. cat. Oh, oh yeah. Cat. Okay, what okay. Name? I'll change my mind. Bye, so what would you say is your red? Flat. I'm a very busy guy. You know, I, I go to college out here. I work my jobs. I do my content stuff, play sports because I just have a lot on my plate. You know, it doesn't mean I'm not going to make time for you. I can just get a little stressed because you know, I'm a busy guy. I, I put a lot on my back. My biggest red flag is like, I'm just really friendly. Like I can really get along with everybody. And sometimes that comes off as being like flirtatious which I'm not. I do travel a lot. Not being in one centralized location, it's kind of, it would be harder um, to hang out. But on the flip side, I'm traveling for work um, and it's, you know, for my goals. And, and it's one, something I'm really passionate about is my content creation. If you don't like traveling, then that could be a red flag there. My red flag is I just be spending too much money on my shoddy. You know what I'm saying? You want this, you want this, you know, Fanny, Fanny, Gucci, Gucci, Penny, Penny. I want you, you oh, know what I'm trying man. to say? You know, money comes and goes, but her smile that lasts forever. <laughs> I cut off people that like disturb my peace. If I don't, if I feel bad energy towards you, I cut you off. Mm. So my friends are really like close to me. I always want my girl to meet all my buddies and have fun with me. You know, we're guys. Sometimes I miss the ball and maybe she wants alone time and I just don't get it. Mm -hmm. But if she tells me, then obviously I know. I don't want to eliminate him because I feel like he makes the room like more like funny. Mm. But mm. sorry, uh, Mike. I'm a but he's so funny. Mike, yeah. Like we keep him in the chat. Whatever the okay. one time, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. uh, I, I didn't even know everyone's sign. What's her sign? Taurus. Well, I know I'm compatible with you because I'm a Cancer. I mean, we're an ideal match. I, I mean, I already feel the chemistry between us like through a screen. Like, can you imagine how great it would be in person? I am a uh, Sagittarius. Is that is that good or? How do you feel about that? She she made a little she had a little oh, face. A little yeah, face. how do you feel about oh, that? Oh oh no no. I know yeah, you know. Sagittarius love your freedom so much. But I'm committed though. I'm not bored. You know, I'm like I'm here. I'm committed. Uh, I'm a Virgo. She brings me down to earth. But he can be very nitpicky, but he doesn't look in the mirror himself. Uh, how can I look in the mirror when I'm busy looking at you? Oh. 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 Yeah. I like it. So I'm a Taurus. Oh. Two Tauruses are very compatible. You and I could support each other through 
life's challenges. And I feel like you and I are both goal oriented. I'm a cancer as well. I I think my rising was Sagittarius. Probably for you. As a Taurus, we like being in control. And I know how you Sagittarius cannot deal with people like that. You love your freedom. You're really big into this like science stuff. Yeah, it's a pattern, guys. Okay. That's cool. I respect that. On my face. Okay. Yeah. Bro, okay. you don't take hey. your oh, hey. He got the burst fade. Okay. okay. Yeah. He looks as yep. good as his car. Mm, okay. <laughs> how tall is everyone? a little bit taller than me like it's okay but it was like shorter than me because my head is five five right? if anyone oh. in this group is shorter than five, five. <laughs> anyone <laughs> anyone shorter than five five right, right now, now. Dude, why are you doing this to us <laughs> <laughs> when i stand on my money <laughs> oh, damn. Damn. Oh, damn. you got it like damn. that damn. Damn. Okay. and i got one dollar <laughs> no, no no we don't tell her that we don't tell her that come on i'm five five oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah but your Yo, personality on, be 63 i'm 5 8 with uh no shoes i'm 5 9 where air fuck ones i'm 6 1 i'm 5 9 jakey because he's the same uh... height as me jakey you wear heels i'll wear them with you we'll twin you know <laughs> <laughs> i mean no, i mean that ain't no way. Way. he's dedicated there he's dedicated some... if he really wanted to he could get uh uh height hey. surgery no oh no God. i would never no, i would never i would never Little guys work pretty hard to make up for it. So you have all okay. these tall guys that didn't build a personality later on. So mm. hear me out. We could always see eye to eye is what I'm saying. Mm. <laughs> Look, he's making, the, he's making the clap back right now, bro. I did try to date someone the same height as me. It's kind of... I'm not used to it. Damn. Oh, no. Close your face. One shirt off, bro. I'm not even f***ing around. <laughs> oh! Oh! oh. oh. Take the shirt off. Take the shirt off. Yes. <laughs> five foot, he's seven foot in bed. He's very, very cute. Actually, he's like, I would say a With ten. Mm. Hey. Ooh. 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 Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. She's a good <laughs> oh, oh my god. Hey, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I love you. Mm. Damn. You know, like princess treatment. What do you think of that? I think that's just baseline. Right? I want to be the one taking care of my girl. I like spending quality time together. And then I also like gift giving. So if we ever want to go shopping for like a GT3 RS, like we can do that too. Mm. Damn, bro. He just, yeah, he just dropped that. He just oh, he's dropped supposed to big bang. <laughs> Damn, okay. He can get you like a model car. Hey. Listen, we can call it a date. You, we'll go to the Porsche dealership and we'll check him out. Mm. Dang. It's like that. You said gifts and, uh, and quality time, and I, I think that lines up perfect with me. I, I don't need gifts myself, but but I love to give them. You know, taking little notes here and there, little reminders of what you say, so I can so I can know later on like what gifts to give you. Kaden, right? Yes, ma'am. You're, you're still in school. Oh yeah, but but I got it like that. Don't worry, I'm almost done. Mm. I got like three more months. Like, mm. oh, three God. more months. That ain't a long time, Cass. I want like a guy who's like already like either my age or like a little bit older you don't know how old i am though some people go to school later in life you know and let me tell you this right here too is uh you know people who graduate with a degree they make a lot more in their job statistically be able to but get how you those old are you how old are you I'm, I'm as old as you want me to be kezia don't don't even worry about <laughs> it <laughs> oh, age, okay, age okay, is a okay. number age is a number you know i'm i'm i've all everyone's told me you know i'm mature beyond my years mm -hmm. you know I don't Ooh. know, but I have a bad experience and like, Ooh. I want my dad to be like, have something going for him, well, you know? Like, well, what do you, what do you do to you? What what happened? What do you do? I don't want the different timeline anymore. I want like more accomplished. Like, I'm not saying you're not accomplished, but like more like with the job wise and like everything. Oh, I I know I got I got my jobs. Don't worry about that. The degree's a formality. I'm just getting my degree because I started it three or four years ago. You know mm. what I'm saying? Like I'm a guy who finishes what he starts. I feel like he's be being very vague. Like Kayla, vague. you're being very like. Wait, Whoa. how's he being vague? He's explaining How, everything he up? can. What's going on? Yeah, no, like, I would never tell lie me, to you. What is your work? Like you said, like it seems like it's very like just like. Okay, yeah, oh, no, what no, no, you no. Okay. Yeah, I got you, Shadi. Exactly I got you. Okay. You want to know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She wants to know. She wants to know. That's cool. Party. I'm dead. Yeah. You know, anything she wants to know, I tell her, right? So first and foremost, I do social media management for a couple different companies. Uh, have you been to SEMA before? 
yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, so I work with SEMA. I work with their uh, leg called Driving Force Action. We actually launched their account for them. I was the face of that account for a couple months. Um, do you know Donut Media, the YouTube channel? Mm -hmm. yeah. They're huge. Yeah, I'm, I'm a contracted writer with them. So I do their research projects. I get I gather lists for them. I write their scripts. Honestly, you've probably seen a couple of the videos that I've wrote for them. Aside from that, I do my own content, right? So I get to travel a lot. Um, I work with Nissan. Nissan USA is real big with me. I, I was out in Sonoma last September driving the new Z Nismo. This is what I want to do for the rest of my life. You know, like those are all the different jobs that I have. But I feel like it's very like everywhere in a place. Like I want like a more guy who has like a... Oh, I get. Oh, you want someone boring? Okay, like, okay. I, yeah, I mean, for people yeah. that may be boring, but I'm more like stable, you know. For what do you do for work? I I'm curious. I'm just a stay-at-home daughter, but I do drifting. You know, she wants what she wants. Okay. She likes what she likes. So, it's not a fit for me, but I know for other people it would be a better fit. Hey, no. what's up? Hey, man, okay. Yes. Pull your pants down. The... <laughs> oh, hey, no, hold on. No, no. Good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, it's it's fun. Nice to meet Why should she choose you? I'm at a point in my life now where I'd like to consider myself very stable. I think before you love someone, you have to be able to love yourself. And I think I'm at a point where in my life to continue something serious. Uh, we're both very into drifting, as you can see by my photo. I'm like that's my GR Corolla that I'm it's an all-wheel drive car I think we have a lot in common we're both Tauruses uh, we both really like cars I could definitely take care of you I have a lot to provide I think I'm very much relating to like the whole cancer definition so I, already right there I really think we're compatible uh, I am a bit older than you uh, not by a lot happy with where I'm at with my career obviously I'm mainly focused on growing so never stop growing uh, I've been really happy with my friends and like my family and like really nurturing those important relationships to me um, so, you know, when the right person comes along, I'll be ready for them, like, physically, mentally, and financially. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, uh, I don't know, this is so hard! Mm, okay. I think I would have to eliminate Caleb. Sorry, Caleb. Okay, here we go. Yeah! Oh, okay. what what is Take your shirt uh, off. No, we're not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> no, this well, is great inside joke meeting then. you, and great meeting you, Nikolai, as well. How do you feel before you reveal your face? You would, do you think you would make this for? Oh uh, yeah, I drive a Corolla for sure. Hmm. So you nah, think I'm because of the Corolla, it made it this far? No, that's complete jokes. <laughs> um, I I would like to say I think the other boys did a phenomenal job. Mm -hmm. I think everyone had great things to offer. Mm -hmm. Um, and I think the energy was good. I think everyone uh, seemed very respectful, seemed very nice. All right, Kes, what Damn, you dude, you're hot. <laughs> no, bro, I'll do it. I'll do it. I, I never dated a white guy. He could be the first. Hmm. I see. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>